What's up everyone, it's Grim Reaper Sages, it's my 3 minute review for House Flipper 2. Uh, shout out to Terminals who are kind enough to give me the review code. This is the PS5 version, it is £32.99. Published and developed by Frozen District and was released on the 10th of the 4th 2024. So let's get into it. So controls are really easy to pick up and play. Um, it's a real chilled vibes really fun relaxing game tools are really cool they all have their own uses and feel to them different stuff such as like hammers for destroying walls and uh trash cans scanner guns are selling stuff stuff like that um there's a lot of skills that you can unlock you can choose which ones you want to unlock as well so like for example the cleaning you can either have um a bigger cleaning cloth or you can unlock the spray bottle that makes it quicker to clean and stuff like that um there's a lot of building and cosmetic items that can be uh chose for missions and you can customize them as well like colors styles designs like that so it's really cool uh, missions are really fun and easy to understand you know it does explain exactly what you need to do if you press touchpad on playstation it does come up like you need to sell x amount you need to clean x amount stuff like that so it's really good uh, there's a lot of content for the for all the game. You know, the single player is really fun. There's sandbox mode where you can do, you know, build your own house. You can flip houses and everything else. It's really fun. Couple little niggles though, however, is for me, um, the controls are kind of fiddly when trying to be precise, such as laying tiles or trying to pick up little items. Um, it can be a little bit fiddly on a controller. I kind of feel like obviously it would have been a bit better on a keyboard and mouse um, and there's no real reason to replay the missions once you've done them once you've done them and you 100 percented them there's no reason to replay them at all you don't really gain anything from it so yeah it hurts the replayability and it can feel a little bit samey because a lot of the missions are very much you go to a house and it's sell so many items clean so many items throw away so many items so it can be quite samey because a lot of it's just rinse and repeat um overall i'd put this as a weight on a sale like i said the controls are easy to pick up tons of customization options chill vibe and everything else um but with uh controls being a bit fiddly no real replayability and the missions can be a bit samey kind of does hurt it as always i hope you enjoyed the video if so please like share subscribe it helps absolutely ton check out my blog which is blog. on there's where i post my fan art and everything else as always, any questions about the game, drop it in the comments. I'll do my best to answer them all, and I'll see you all soon.